Hi everyone, so welcome to my channel. If you're new, I would love it if you would subscribe. So today, as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be doing gender prediction. I have a few here that I've written down. I'm also going to be keeping score of it. We'll see what the outcome is. I do want to make a little disclaimer before I continue that I don't believe any of these. This video is purely just for fun. So I did do the Chinese calendar and it said that I was going to have a boy. So if you're craving citrus and sweet stuff, you're going to have a girl. If you're craving meats and salt, you are going to have a boy. So I kind of have been craving lots of fruit and in general kind of sweet stuff, not per se ice cream or anything like that, but like sweet bread. I've been really craving that. That is a point for the girls. So the next one is morning sickness it's a girl if you have little to no morning sickness it's a boy so i don't really have morning sickness it's like sickness all day if i don't eat and it's kind of been more rough than it has been with the boys pregnancies it's another point for the girls so what i'm going to show you right now is the ring test so i um basically got keychain because i don't actually have any rings i don't wear any jewelry if you guys don't already know that i'll show you the two clips that i took to me it looked like i was moving back and forth so definitely giving that point to the boys if you disagree or in any of these if you see something else definitely leave your guess down below in the comments so the next two that i also did was the cabbage test and the baking soda test i did a separate clip on that so i'm going to insert that right now so you can guys see it hey everyone so right now i'm going to be doing the baking soda test and the cabbage test for the gender predictions and I look like a hot mess because today was just a hot mess of a day. I am boiling the cabbage right now. It's got seven minutes left to boil and then um, I already have the baking soda here. I am going to be showing the actual cups so if you guys don't want to see this, um, little disclaimer, you know it's obviously gonna show my pee which is kind of gross the fact that i'm sharing this with you guys anyways and before anybody says about the color of it today we didn't have any water bottles i've literally only had two water bottles today which i need to like drink a whole bunch more before i even go to sleep so that's the reason why it's so dark i am always thirsty like right now i'm really thirsty so after i film this i'm going to drink a whole nother water bottle i'm just always thirsty all the time so i'm constantly drinking water so don't judge me for that i cut up water bottles because i didn't have any disposable cups and i didn't really want to pee inside of my cups like i did with my last pregnancy that's super weird i don't know why i ever did that so here is um the cabbage water it says to put equal parts so i didn't measure anything i'm just kind of eyeballing it to be honest with a cabbage chest if it turns pink or red it's going to be a boy and if it turns purple it's girl this one was actually right when i did mine for benaya all of these things is completely for fun i don't actually believe that um these will actually tell you the gender of your baby i'm gonna pour it in and i want to know what you guys think about this Okay, so that's what it looks like. It looks purple to me, but then I thought that about Benaya's too. So I think I'm just going to pour all of it in there. Right. So that definitely looks purple. So a point for the girls. It, it does not look like Benaya's at all. I'll try to get a clip of that and show you guys what that looked like. But this definitely looks purple. Got the pea here. I have the baking soda in here. It says to put in equal parts. But I kind of feel like this baking soda is a little bit too much for it. I don't know. So basically with the baking soda test, if it fizzles, boy. If it doesn't do anything, it's a girl. So I actually zoomed it in so you guys could see a little bit better. To see if it fizzles or not since it's kind of hard with the lines of the bottle. I'm gonna pour it in. Does that count? Is it doing anything? Oh, I think there's it's a little bit of fizzling going on, I think. Can you guys see that? I 
Okay, see the little bubbles on top? Oh, there's definitely some fizzling there, I think. I'm going to count this as a boy. I wonder if I just pour the whole thing, it'll do anything. So there's some bubbles in there. I don't know if you guys see that. So that is a point for the boys. So that is it for the gender prediction test. Honestly, I think I'm having a boy still. My mind has not changed after that. I really, really want a girl, obviously, after having two boys. I still think it's a boy, honestly. Um, let me know down in the comments below what you think it's going to be, regardless of these little gender prediction tests that I've done. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll see you for my next video. Bye, guys.